Business insurance is a form of financial protection designed to help businesses protect their assets and employees. It can provide coverage for losses due to negligence, accidents, or other unforeseen events. Having business insurance can give you peace of mind that your business is protected from unexpected costs and liabilities. With proper coverage, you will have the security knowing that your company will be able to continue operations if something happens such as damage caused by natural disasters or a liability lawsuit brought against the company. Furthermore, having business insurance may also make it easier for your business to obtain loans from lenders since they know that potential risks are covered in case of any unfortunate circumstances. Types of Business Insurance General liability insurance is a type of business insurance that covers legal claims or injuries caused by negligence, accidents, or other unfortunate events. It provides coverage for medical expenses, property damage and legal fees in the event of an incident. This type of insurance can help to protect your company from liability when customers visit your business premises or use products you provide. Property insurance protects businesses from any damages to their physical assets such as buildings, equipment, furniture and inventory due to natural disasters like fires, floods and earthquakes as well as vandalism or theft. Property insurance helps businesses recover financially after experiencing major losses associated with these types of incidents. Counterfeit insurance is a specialized form of liability coverage designed for companies that produce goods that are subject to counterfeiting risk, such as luxury items. Counterfeit protection helps cover losses related to counterfeit production costs associated with product replicas created without permission from the original manufacturer. Workers' compensation insurance is a type of insurance required by law in many states, which provides payments and medical care benefits for employees who become injured while on the job regardless if it was their own fault or not. This helps employers manage risk and provide financial stability during periods when employees are unable to work due to illness injury sustained at work-related activities. Cyber liability insurance is designed specifically for online businesses since they face potential risks posed by cyber criminals such as identity theft, malicious software attacks and data breaches which may lead to significant financial loss depending on severity level involved. Cyber liability insurance offers protection against these threats helping companies recover quickly in case something happens so operations can resume back up again normally afterwards. Professional liability insurance is typically bought by companies providing services instead of tangible goods since this form covers them from being sued over errors made during service provisioning process commonly known malpractice lawsuits brought against them by dissatisfied clients. Pricing of business insurance Pricing of business insurance can be a complex process since there are many factors that affect the rates. The amount of coverage needed, location and industry type are some of the most important ones when determining insurance rates. Additionally, certain conditions such as age, size of business and number of employees also play a role in pricing. When it comes to finding affordable coverage for your business, you should consider comparing different providers to see which one offers competitive prices for the coverage you need. It is also recommended to research about potential discounts available from insurers such as loyalty or multiple policy discounts that may help lower premiums significantly. Furthermore, understanding what's covered by each policy is essential so you don't end up paying more than necessary for something that isn't included in your plan and going over different riders offered by companies can also help make sure that everything is accounted for before making any decisions. Finally, being aware of state laws regarding insurance policies will give you better insight on how much protection your company needs based on geographical area where operations take place plus local regulations related to them too. Who needs business insurance? Small businesses are the backbone of many communities, and they often face a variety of risks that can put their finances in jeopardy. Business insurance can help protect small business owners against losses due to liability claims or property damage, as well as provide coverage for the costs associated with defending lawsuits brought against them. This type of coverage is essential for protecting these companies from financial ruin should an unfortunate incident occur. Medium-sized businesses have additional risks that come with increased responsibility, such as hiring more employees and investing in larger amounts of capital equipment. 
in order to properly protect themselves from potential liabilities and other unforeseen circumstances, it is important for medium-sized businesses to invest in comprehensive business insurance policies that cover all areas from general liability to professional indemnity protection. Large enterprises typically operate on much larger scales than smaller companies and are exposed to even greater risks due to their size and complexity. Having proper business insurance coverage helps these organizations protect their assets and investments so they can remain viable regardless of any unexpected events or incidents which may arise during operations. Depending on the nature of each company's activities different types of coverage will be needed such as product liability, property damage slash theft protection or workers' compensation insurance among others, making sure everything is accounted for beforehand can ensure full security while conducting daily tasks without worrying about hefty out-of-pocket expenses if something goes wrong later down the line. Filing Claims for Business Insurance Filing a claim for business insurance can be a daunting task but it is important to understand the process in order to ensure that your company receives the coverage and compensation it deserves. There are two main types of claims filing options available, direct and indirect. Direct filing involves submitting an application directly with the insurer, while indirect claims require working through an intermediary such as a broker or agent. The steps involved in filing a claim will depend on the type of policy you have purchased and your specific provider's procedures. Generally speaking, however, most policies require certain information such as contact details of all parties involved in the incident, detailed description of what happened, photos slash documentation related to damage caused by incident, estimated costs associated with reparations, and proof that loss was not prevented due to any negligence on behalf of insured party. When preparing your claim it is important to provide accurate information at all times since any false or misleading data may result in reduced compensation or even denial depending on severity level involved if detected by insurers during investigation stage afterwards. Additionally, having records ready beforehand can save time and make paperwork easier when filing to bypassing need for additional investigations so funds can be released faster after received confirmation from them regarding everything being correct before submission date arrives later down line 2 then finally outcome arrived at when finish line reached near shortly afterwards soon next years after now hereby here on beginning now. To help streamline process there are some tips you should keep in mind when filling out forms related to business insurance claims, read all instructions carefully before starting work, double check each piece of information submitted, name spellings, dates etc, clearly explain why you believe there's coverage under policy purchased previously earlier prior there to for back timely aforesaid first off formerly initially, provide supporting documents whenever possible, photos slash estimates, so they don't have go through extra trouble verifying things themselves later afterwards instead accordingly, correspondingly, similarly likewise conversely. Conclusion When selecting a business insurance policy, it is important to consider the type and size of your company as well as its operations. Different policies are available that provide coverage for different areas such as general liability, property damage slash theft protection or workers' compensation insurance among others, making sure everything is accounted for beforehand can ensure full security while conducting daily tasks without worrying about hefty out-of-pocket expenses if something goes wrong later down the line. Additionally, understanding what's covered by each policy is essential so you don't end up paying more than necessary for something that isn't included in your plan and going over different riders offered by companies can also help make sure that all potential risks have been taken into consideration. Pricing of business insurance can be a complex process since there are many factors that affect the rates. The amount of coverage needed, location and industry type are some of the most important ones when determining insurance rates. Additionally, certain conditions such as age, size of business and number of employees also play a role in pricing. When it comes to finding affordable coverage for your business, you should consider comparing different providers to see which one offers competitive prices for the coverage you need. It is also recommended to research about potential discounts available from insurers such as loyalty or multiple policy discounts that may help lower premiums significantly. In conclusion, having proper business insurance coverage helps protect businesses against losses due to liability claims or property damage, while providing them with financial stability during periods when they face unexpected incidents or lawsuits brought against them by dissatisfied clients etc. at all thusly thenceforth here after forever consequently whence thenceforth lastly finally conclusively.
Your support will help us continue to produce high-quality content that will benefit the business community. So, don't wait any longer, hit that subscribe button, share our videos with your friends and family, and give us a like. We'll see you in the next video. Thank you for watching.